Some new video showing police arresting a man for impersonating an officer. Investigators say the man claimed that he was working for a police department in South Georgia. Channel 2's Tom Regan live in Norcross today. Tom, the man had a gun and was out there directing traffic. Yeah, Justin, he was working here at the intersection of Buford Highway and Holcomb Bridge Road a couple of weeks ago doing traffic control. A local cop spotted him and saw the way he was dressed and said something didn't seem right. Hey, you're just trying to figure out who you worked for. Oh, Talbot. The city of Talbot. Okay. That's Daryl Henderson. He was directing traffic for a private company dressed in a police uniform from the city of Talbotton. That's about 100 miles south of Atlanta. He was dressed in majority police gear, a duty belt, gun, holster, ass baton, taser. The officer was surprised the man would come so far for a private part-time job. You just got your uh, like police ID? Yeah. Just put everybody at, at ease and we'll... Do you work there or you just only do this? I work there. Oh, okay. The officer grew suspicious and contacted the Talbotton Police Department to confirm the man's employment. Turns out he doesn't work there. I just talked to them and they said you were terminated February 8th. So you were lying to me. Then. No, I'm actually reserved for them, but I guess they terminated him. No. Yeah, trying to do what I need to do, man. Police arrested Henderson on charges of impersonating a police officer. Police say this kind of misrepresentation undermines public trust of law enforcement and cannot be tolerated. The public should be concerned if they see something that doesn't look like a police officer to call the local police agency that they're at. Mr. Henderson is free on bond. You know, I reached out to the Talbotton Police Department to find out why this guy was let go last month, but no one answered the phone. Live in Gwinnett County, Norcross, Tom Regan, Channel 2, Action News. All right, Tom, thank you for that. It is bizarre to say the least.